State's over. Retiring these. Congratulations to Benilde St. Margaret, on, by the way, on getting State. Uh, I don't know how the girls' hockey turned out. It's Monday. That's me. I got paper all over the place. Today is March 12th, 2012, 3-12-12. Does that mean anything? No. But in nine months, if someone were to get pregnant today, they could have a 12-12-12 baby. I'm going to work on that. No, I'm not. It's 6.11 p.m. Current temperature is 48 degrees. It's been cloudy, cold, and rainy on day. All day. Cloudy, cold, and rainy. And gray. All day. And on your radio, it's sunny. 102. So it's going to be 70 tomorrow. So at least we got that to look forward to. I still came to work in shorts. If I get back far enough, these are my shorts. These are the shorts that fall off, too. It's always such a... Shock to the system going from pants to shorts. Don't you hate pants? Over the weekend, Ellie Blades asked, does anyone wear pants by choice? People only wear pants because they have to. Now, I think she's talking about skirts, but I agree. If it weren't cold out, I'd wear shorts all the time. These aren't really shorts anyway. They're cargo shorts. They go down to my knee. Mini skirts are shorter than these. Shorts are long. So... Anyway, never get your hopes up for a basketball team. That's what I've learned from being a Sacramento Kings fan and now from being a Minnesota Timberwolves fan. Poor Ricky. He's taking it so well. He's so smiley. How can you not love that guy? He's so cute. But I did wear black in his honor. It's my Three Wolf Moon shirt. Christmas present from Aaron. Thank you, Aaron. Have you seen Aaron's beard? He posted a video of his own. I don't know why he was silent, but I guess that was to enhance the Joaquin Phoenixness of it all. And I don't know if he was making moves to be an imitation of me, or it's just that because we're related, we have the same moves. But he's doing a lot of bugging out his eyes and weird stuff. And I have to tell you, as soon as I saw that video, and if you need, if you haven't seen that video, you'll have to probably find it on the W or ask me for the link because it's unlisted and I don't know how widely he wants to distribute it but as soon as I saw that video I got right up and I started shaving I did not I am too lazy and it was a lazy Sunday but I I've seen the future and it looks like Aaron and I will shave before we get that far I might shave uh, tomorrow tonight if I get time I don't know my problem is you can see my beard from here to here is just gray now, so it's not as much fun as it was 10 years ago when it was just a, a neck beard. I was big into the neck beard. In fact, I think I got married with the neck beard. I'll have to go back and check my wedding pictures. But, yeah, it was like very, very nice and shaggy, but very clean shaven everywhere else. Faux Amish. I have a big pimple right here, though. That thing hurt like a mother yesterday. Let me tell you more about myself. Let me not, because there are a lot of comments over the weekend, not all dealing with Aaron's beard, that I must address. Comment on YouTube from Stuart. How old school is your mouse? I guess during one of those times when I was panning down, you caught a glimpse of my mouse. Now, this mouse isn't that old, really. Whoops, sorry. It's not that old. But it did come with my original desktop. And I kept it because the trackpad kind of sucked and the little duver that you push on kind of sucks and I wanted a mouse so I still have this mouse connected to my laptop Woo! make it make it screw up Ooh, look you can see my camera sort of in the reflection and I've worn a nice little groove in it where my uh, when I left click but I don't want a new one so I'm not going to ask Enrique to buy me a new one I'm sure he would give me one uh, I did get a new keyboard because my original keyboard was uh, had a PS2 connector and not a USB connector. 
So I love my old keyboard. This one's wrong because the pipe key is down here in the corner. It shouldn't be here. It should be up here. But you find yourself always hitting enter prematurely when you need to be hitting pipe. But it is washable. It says it's washable anyway. I've never actually washed it. I could, though. I'm sure it's got a lot of crumbs in it. Speaking of which, I finished my mixed nuts. So, the person who complains about never seeing me eat anything, because it's late at night and I've, after lunch there's, you know, not a lot of snacking going on. How fat do you want me to get? Anyway, this, ma this mouse did not cause the network outage, Stuart. Thank you for your theory. It has been considered and debunked. Ron. Your name's Ron, right? I should look this stuff up before I start. Yep, Mr. Dudley. The formerly... Uh, whoops. Camera's falling over again. The formerly mute keeper who we finally convinced to talk and then uh, talk, talk, talk. Boy, that guy just never stops talking. He wants me to know he's watched all the videos as well. I, I, more and more of you are saying that you watch all of these. So I guess what happens is you either watch all of them or you watch none of them. Or you watch one and then never watch them again. I didn't check my stats for last week, but we can, we can talk about my ratings uh, another night. I would only consider myself a completist if what I am trying to complete is readily available. If I had to search through five sets to find these through five sites to find these, I would most likely give up. That's why I post them everywhere, even though I reckon I'm only getting a few in each place, but if I don't, I'll probably lose that slim piece of the pie of those people who watch me on Google+, or watch me on Facebook, or watch me on YouTube, or watch me on The W. And again, there are probably analytics that can tell me where I'm succeeding and where I'm failing, but I'm just... I don't have that much time in the day. Although it seems like I always seem to have 10 minutes to do this. I just make it uh, look like I have no time. Or all the time in the world. What am I saying? I don't know. Might as well ask a question while I'm here. I am so glad you did. As someone who's in need of a new office chair, the piston in my 10 plus, I'm going to assume 10 plus year old chair broke this week. Now I feel like I'm sitting on the floor. How would you rate your office chair? Is it comfortable? I have the option of getting one like it. I love the high chair. It's very high because, I don't know, it's, it's hard to find these anymore, but this one's actually got some wear and tear. You can tell it did break right here. There's some duct tape holding this armrest together, but yeah, I really like it. But I like being able to sit high, and I don't sit, I, I kind of alternate between sitting high and standing. I can't stand when I do this, though. I look like this. Well, I mean, I could fix the camera, but look at the lighting get all weird. Look at all that white space, too. I wonder if we could put something on the ceiling. Anyway. Yeah, I like it, but it's not... Again, I've had it for several years. There are newer chairs in this office somewhere. I don't know if they're high or not. Never move the camera because you'll spend the rest of the time just fidgeting with it. Anyway, those newer ones are blue. This one's orange. Doesn't matter. A lot of Febreze. Yes, I like it. Otherwise, I wouldn't use it. Where are my target center seats? Would you consider them good or just okay? They're good. They are straight on to the court. They're the rightmost if you're watching on TV. So, baseline, our section is up against the baseline. It's not one of these corner kind of deals, so it's pretty good. The weird thing about it is people who you can tell are not season ticket holders always wander into my section, and inevitably they will have tickets for the better seats one section over, but they won't realize it. No one has ever come down to sit in our section and, and had worse seats. It's always They've always been better seats. I don't know what that means. Holy crap, it's been 10 minutes. Well, we'll catch up tomorrow. I'll whine about Rubio tomorrow. 
I gotta close now. I'll see you tonight for Raw, maybe, on Twitter. Uh, otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow, or whenever it's tomorrow in my world.